It's terrifying the state you leave me in, you know? <laughs> yeah, well, if you would just take on the terror missions, we wouldn't be in this state. Hey, I tried, man. I tried. Yeah, two pistol clips, but no pistols. Really? Oh, no, it would have been for uh, for little me. Yes. That's why. Uh, yeah, I, I, I knew that. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see here. We need some stun rods. We have med kits at least. Alright, at least we have some money. We only have two suits of personal armor though. Ugh. Okay. We need research. We have 50 researchers. We have 35 engineers working on med kits. We don't need med kits, they'll stop production. We need armor. We barely have alien alloys. Oh my god. I need to make alien alloys. <laughs> uh, we'll see if we can do it kind of decently here. Produce a bunch of them, and then personal armor will have the rest of them work on... Oh, that's all of our space. Well, humph. Well, fine then. We'll just have to... Settle for that. Hopefully I get a UFO that I can shoot down and we can use the alien alloys then for that. It's gonna be one of those really quiet months, isn't it? Yeah, I was gonna say you'll get a really nice easy month. And then I'll fuck it all up again. <laughs> Swings and roundabouts, isn't that isn't that what they say? Strikes and valley. Uh strikes and valley, strikes and gutters. No. Oh. You'd think I'd learn after screwing up from my Resident Evil episode, but never mind. Well, that's what the Big Lebowski said, didn't it? Strikes and gutters? It, I don't this know. Is the, he said one of the things. I'm American. I only, I only pretend to know these things. <laughs> hey, there we go. Oh, fun, fun, fun. So we still have Jack. We have... <laughs> okay. So we get to do... This fun bit. Ah, fuck it. We'll just leave it like that. And we have two suits of armor. Woo. Being a bit selfish here. There you go. You and me. Wow. I might have said give mine to someone else, but it's your call, sir. Nope. You're actually really accurate. Honestly, I probably would have gone with you and the few because I think you're the two most accurate. But, uh... Well, <laughs> fuck it, fuck it, selfish. <laughs> <laughs> so seriously though, this um, <clears throat> this month. There we go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's coming right for us. What are we equipped with on the uh, interceptors? Stingray cannon. Okay. I'm half tempted to go to go with some avalanche longers the Aval what? Avalanche launchers. Wow. Um Avalanche Longers are the are the the launcher missile? <laughs> well, because they're the longer range. Um so I was thinking about just throwing that on instead of the cannon. Because with the avalanche, we can actually outrange terror ships. Hmm. And then just hope your shots are enough. Mm-hmm. Yeah, two interceptors, dual wielding avalanche, can take down a terror ship. I have seen it. Yep, yep, there it is. <gasps> Yay, you get a terror mission. 
<laughs> yep. But we already had one this month. Uh, we had one this month. Why? Why? Why there two? Maybe this one's early, or maybe yours is just really late. Hmm. I don't think we actually need this many electro flares. I'm pretty sure we're gonna get there during the day. There we go. I think. I think that's everything. A couple of pistol clips. Three. Sure. Cool. Uh, maybe we've done another piece of armor? No, not any nanner. Um, the few. And... Jack, I'm taking your armor off. You're out for like two months. Um, Hope you don't mind. Jason was fairly accurate, and I th think Gambit, though his bravery was really low. Whoops. Gambit 51, oh. Yeah, so Jason and Ken. Okay. Who actually is Quen the second, but Ken, because that's how they wanted it. Just to be confusing, and then it's another spelling for the next one. Just to give us a hard time. Yeah, it's uh, Quen with a K-W <laughs> next time, and then Quen with a Q-U. Yes. yes. Yep. Uh, should we build a general stores or living quarters or anything? Well, I was wondering about a living quarters when, you know, you hired those 13 soldiers and mm -hmm. couldn't hire anyone else. Yeah. Yeah. The one that same token, we also need to put up another base at one point. Indeed, a production base. For the monies. And a secondary squad base, we should be getting that up pretty soon too. Hmm. We're, uh, we're doing really well. <clears throat> <laughs> at least living quarters are really cheap. And then another base, if we were to do it, where do you think? Well, with the... Would somewhere in the Americas not be wise? Well, or... Americas would be good, South Africa would be good, Asia would be good. Not so much Australia. Sorry, Australia, you guys don't pay for shit. Mm. Um, so usually one of those. I'd be half tempted just to say Asia, just so we have pretty much complete coverage over Eurasia. But, I don't know, you're a commander too. If you think <laughs> we should go for the Americas, then... We well, the, really, the only reason, I, well, apart from the fact that, you know, we've got nothing over there at the moment, um, mm -hmm. they they fund quite a lot, don't they? But then Asia's not bad for funding either. No, and then UFO activity in areas, North America is going up. There's South America. I think it's probably the terror ship, though. Um, and then... Is that it for the Americas? Really? Just two? I guess so. But then we have Southern Africa is nothing. Okay. Um, Europe. Yeah, Africa's fine. Asia's fine. Australasia's fine. Yeah, so I guess the Americas then, if anywhere. That's where Ooh. the activity's at right now. Called it. <laughs> so we'll see if we can afford it. America's expensive. I'd like to get... Probably, probably in Florida there somewhere. Get the majority of the United States, Canada, all of Mexico, and some of South America. For 800,000. Fine. Um, why not? I'll trust you didn't make any horrible mistakes uh, in the last few seconds. Uh, Skype had a fit. And I lost audio and, vis and video. Nah, we're good. I just put it up in Florida there, named it Murica. So we're good. Uh, Sky Range is already heading out. We should get there during the day. So there's that. This has, can I just say, this has made my weekend. Yeah, me doing the terror mission? Yeah, Saturday morning, weekend made, I'm not doing a terror mission. Well, spoiler alert, it's going to be mutons and I'm going to abort, so... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> No, even if it is mutants, laser rifles, I'll still try it. You never know. Uh, I think we're pretty much done equipping people here. Got a lot of spare equipment, though. 
which is making me nervous. I feel like I forgot something major. <laughs> it's like some people, they don't have the strength for a stun rod in addition to the rest of their equipment. So I think I got most of it done, though. I don't know, this is when I hit OK and I realized that I fucked everything up horribly. Fuck! <sighs> Alright, can't I... Yeah, arrow keys. Boy, it's a bit quick, though. There we go. Alright. First things first. Speck of smoke. Oh. One death. A lot of shooting and missing. Oh, two deaths. Oh. Three. <laughs> Holy shit. Was that a reaction shot with a rocket launcher? <laughs> Into a gas station or something. Oh my god, 99er it was. That thing that moved across. <laughs> he just took a shot at it. Took out the gas station. Well, that's a, that's a lot of smoke for us to use. Thank you for that, sir. <laughs> KP Ozo, you want to toss some another uh, another big in there? Whoops. There you go. Enjoy. Turns out it was a Civi, just 99ers really itchy on that trigger. Why? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't grab the rocket. Oh, well. I think I'll be all right. And let's get... Let's get Krug. I'll, I'll lead the way there. Ooh. Always hesitant to pull the sniper out so early. Ooh. Um, that means Grays, yes? Yes. One of them. Good luck, sir. Let's see here. 17, 17. Yeah, we can do two. Right? God. I think that's three hits. Fuck. Oh. Okay, well, well, now we need to get him dead, pretty much. And I don't know if the few can pull it off from way back here. No line of fire. Ah, shit, now what? Oh, it's him. Okay, good. Thought it was something different. Auto fire with a few, I'm sorry! Oh, come on! Alright. Tension's killing me! Just kill him! If only. <sighs> All right, KPO Zoa, move out of the way. Moved you a little too much. I don't think you can shoot from here. We'll try it though. No line, no line, no line, no line, okay. Because we're rocking. Yeah, that's a really terrible angle. And that leaves you with just a snapshot. That you can't take. Okay, well, we're just gonna have to hunker down and hope for the best here. I think really the only person at risk there is Krug. And I don't want to get too many more people out in case of grenade from whatever that was over there. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> We're okay. It shot once, took out the wall. Um, if we can scout it... That's bullshit. We can probably... What? What's bullshit about it? It's fine. If I were playing, that would have been a squad wipe or something. Well, yeah. But I'm me. This game and I, we've got a history, you know. <laughs> okay, so if you step out just a little bit... Okay, Arata, you've done well. Run! <laughs> Still see him for a quick snapshot. Oh! Ah! Oh. Right over the shoulder. 99er. Alright. Kneeling snapshot. Ooh. Fuck! Took out a light post. <laughs> <laughs> Takes out the belly of the, um, the Sky Ranger there. I yeah, just nails the landing gear, lops off the front of the ship. <laughs> I've had that with, uh... The blaster bombs and TFTD taking out just like the entire <laughs> front of the Triton. I, I'm sure. Just I've completely seen that. exposed cockpit. It's horrible. <laughs> Thirty-eight, going for a name shot. Asking the pilot to hold his oh, breath yeah. on the way back. <laughs> Could you imagine flying that without the fucking cockpit? <laughs> That'd really get your cheeks flapping.
Yeah, fuck lampposts. <laughs> fuck this town. Well done, team. We've taken out the gas station, taken out their orchard, uh, <laughs> smoked up the Sky Ranger, and destroyed light poles and the road. That's an expensive repair there. Mm -hmm. That'll that'll take months to do. Oops. Okay, though. Let's get Gambit out there. He's fairly accurate. There you go. Everybody huddle around. Actually, let's get you out there. I've started watching this new Daredevil series, and uh, they're, of course, they're in New York, and they're referring to the events of the Avengers as the incident, which trashed half the city. And so th this is just what's happening here. You know, there's the people of Caracas are going to be referring to, oh, the incident when that ship came down from the sky, fucked up our city. Thanks, XCOM. Fucking XCOM. <laughs> there you go. Dinging a, a rocket off the back of his head. <laughs> I feel like we need another rocketeer. Somebody request a rocketeer so we can just get Team Rocket back. The good oh. old days, the glory days of Team Rocket. Oh. Thread and needles. Those are those are some butt clenching moments there. Possibly my favorite parts of Xenonauts. Rod is upsetting something. Oh, it's just him. Aim shot. Oh dear. <laughs> Krug steps out of it. He might be able to get an angle. No line of fire. Holding control. Whoops. That's the window screw. <laughs> <laughs> Holding control. Try again, sir. Oh, another oh. dead lamppost. Oh no, he didn't even kill the lamppost. Poor show. Oh my god. Ooh. Hey -o. Hey -o. Well done, Krug. <laughs> uh, holding control is basically just assuming direct control. I might have to steal the soundbite for that. Uh, it's a Mass Effect reference. You wouldn't get it. Tisk tisk. Was it... Did you do that with the orders, orders received thing? Uh, no, that was just me going orders received and adding filters. Uh... Trying to figure out what the fuck did we shoot at over here? <laughs> I think it went inside, but I can't be certain. So, the few. Um... Step up to here, kneel, get ready for some aim shots. Uh, KPO Zoa, you accurate as well? Kind of, 53. Not the grat, not that great, but we'll try it anyway. And 99er kind of playing middleman here, hanging out wherever I need him to be. <laughs> In the middle, he can swing any direction. Krug stepping up, Rada following this little squadron out here, and we need a second group. Oops. Okay, we need a second group <laughs> plus one. No, no, that's Rata going in, going back in the ship to go, hey guys, we need a second group. You see, you see, oh, you see. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Our radio's broken, guys. <laughs> oh, fuck. He's in the grocery store. <gasps> what a, uh, I, no. He threw a grenade. That little asshole down there. Aim shot! Auto fire! Ah, right in the chin. Skype didn't deign to show me that, so all I got was the... Krug's gone unconscious. <laughs> so Krug shielded your eyes for you. Oh, there's no one there. Oh shit. Who was that? So, one dead, one unconscious? Yeah, Krug's over here unconscious. Yeah. I'll see if I can save him next turn. Um, run for it. Yeah, run for it. Uh, Gambit, you chicken. As we all just slowly suffocate now. Okay, you're not hurt. You're not hurt. You're not hurt. 
So Krug's the only one who got injured and one casualty. Come on, 99er. Where, are you, where were you with that reaction shot? God. <laughs> 36 reactions. That's actually pretty good for a rookie. I think that caps at 40. Not bad. Just another civilian dying. Ah, just one fatal wound. That's fine. Uh, stimulants for that, I think. Painkillers to help him? I don't know. He stabilized at the very least. You know what, KPO, head over here with 99er. Scout for 99er and he'll sort of be your sniper. Because rockets. <laughs> They worked in Xenos, just hang out at the end of the street, and there you go. It's a corner of the map. It's the worst that could happen. God, another f Ah! No, I don't want you. Oh, boy. Oh, he's lucky. We're four time minutes too short for that. Keep you zero. Get down! Get back in the smoke! And we're just gonna have to just auto-fire him. Or... What's your throwing arm like? Pretty bad. Do it anyway. XCOM! I need to throw it here because the roof is still up, yeah? Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Alright. Well then. Underarm it! <laughs> Keep going! <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Woo. Cover. Wait. Alright, well, this building's clear. Someone's house and they've just got a pyramid of cans in there. Because. Well, yeah, isn't that how you do it? No, ours is more of a, a, a cuboid arrangement. Oh, that's lame. Oh, through <gasps> the landing gear! What a shot! Forty-three, Neil. Forty-eight, seventy-seven percent chance of hitting. Ooh. Go! Mm. Oh. In the face with a pistol, really? What? It's like the scene from Saving Private Ryan at the end when he's shooting the <laughs> tank with a pistol and it just blows up. What? Well, that that works, right? Surely you should have done it the other way around then, so you could ding it with a pistol and then ninety-nine or lobs the rocket in. There we go. Ah, sorry about your town. Oh my god, this is gonna render for poop. Alright, well then. Uh, next. You know, for rookies, we're actually doing okay. So I've just jinxed it. But, uh... <laughs> I don't know what the big deal is, man. These cyberdists are pretty, uh, pretty trash. Too soon? <laughs> I, I, I know I fucked up, but I got some GIMP cyberdisc placement on my terror mission. <sighs> Jesus, that was uh, close. There's three of them. Oh, oh, we have to blow him up this turn. <laughs> the few. This is like all on you, the few. Uh... No misclicks. Well, what's the roof like? Yeah, that won't work. Okay, never mind. Put that back. Okay, the few. Kneeling, auto fire. Yes! Yes! Ooh. Actually, I think the first one hit the floor. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> two two grays down as well. Efficient. That still only counts as one. 